breaking windows. Oh. So cruel! Children! They refuse to let Casey play their games because he's reading the rules. They're reading the rules uh, while they're playing the game. He, they're re Casey would rather read the rules than play the game. It, it seems to me like Casey... Casey, you, you could go places. You could be a game inventor, and then all those stupid kids that made fun of you, now they're dancing to your tune because you make the rules, Casey. Don't dance with all of them. Be the rule maker. Let's, let's hear another sad song from Casey's life. My glasses on my head sure improve my view. They make it quite clear that I'm a DU. I think it's quite obviously clear to see. My glasses help improve my ocularity. Ocularity? Ocula- Wow! Oh my gosh! <laughs> Ocularity! Maybe I'm just downplaying this game, but uh, I did not come into Freddy Fish expecting to see words like Ocularity. <laughs> wow! Casey, you have gained nothing but my own respect. Oh, I like to calculate cause it helps me to see all the wonderful stuff that a number can be. I love adding up the rows and the columns you see. Yes, there's always calculations to be done by me. Casey, your your quest for knowledge really touches me, and I'm sad that people would stigmatize you for being the uh, knowledge seeker that you are. I mean, yeah, I'd want you to cut up, cut loose, and have a little bit of fun, but this this kid's already doing like bioengineering pills and stuff, pharmacological uh, advances made by this little fish. My goodness, I'm just I'm impressed. I, one more, one more from Casey, and then we'll move along. Ah, uh, it's the lunch song. You know, I have to say, aside from Luther, the voice acting, particularly the singing in this game, is actually pretty good. For little kid voices, th these are actually really good voice acting, especially for the 90s, where it was kind of a little bit more iffy than it is today. Especially for just like a little kid's program. Okay. I want to go see what's up with that stranger. That stranger over there. Let's go. Okay, it's a kindly stranger with a trench coat. That's a tre trench cloak. Uh, this, this thing's just gonna open that cloak, and there's either gonna be, there's gonna be one of two things right there. There's either gonna be a gaping hole to another dimension, or there's just gonna be stonking, great, big ol' flapping, uh, hands. Yeah. Uh, aren't you kids supposed to be in school today? Uh, yes, mister. You trying to get the things. The things to build a trap to get the ghost. Oh, I got the things the for you. Uh, haunting the schoolhouse? Sorry I asked. Uh, okay. Mild-mannered adult spends his time ridiculing school children for not being in school. Mind your own beeswax, old man. Oh, there we go. There was nothing. A top-notch hodgepodge wristwatch just for fun. Huh? Too bad I already sold the last one. Smooth. So he was selling wristwatches, apparently. Ah, he's the stereotypical uh, man who steals fancy watches and then sells them at back alleys for exorbitant prices so that he can feed his habits. Wonderful, but his his smile, his smile and his customer service is what keeps bringing us back. That's why he sold the last one out. S play us another tune, Sam. An octopus bought a super duper duper book of Holly Gizmo. Whoa. Super duper 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 pocket That's gizmo. Nice. Spending all your money on goodies and trinkets. Man, this guy's this guy's got some tunes. Hey kids, don't go taking any wooden urchins. Why? Oh, maybe he is urchins the currency here? Cause I know they used to have wooden pennies or wooden quarters, like fake money. Is that is that really have we subjected urchins, little nothing of a life form to currency? My goodness. Better move along, kids. You're blocking traffic. Real boomp roadkill. Hey kids. Don't go taking any wooden urchins. I like this guy's voice, and that concerns me because I feel like this guy could easily spirit me away to his his sweatshop where I craft the poorly made watches that he sells to people when they think that he's actually stolen them. Have I got a bargain 
in a basket for you. Oh, he's got a bargain. He's going to make a deal with the devil with us. When you come and see me beneath the ocean blue. And beneath the ocean blue. I like how Freddy and Luther are just like jamming out. They're just swinging their fins back and forth. I sure don't like the way that phony ghost of town sure looks pretty from here. Yeah. Luther, I like the town sure line. Bright lights, big city, what a life for a fish. Big city. Bright light, bright light, I'm ready to take on the... Knock, knock, honey. It's my time to get in the clam. Knock, knock. It's time for me to collect the, the rent that she owes me. Nug nug, it's part of the band. Hey, oh my god, there's a fight going on here. Oh, oh my god, there's a fight going on. Blah, 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 blah. What? Apparently there was a fight there between that uh, female fish, the landlord fish, and uh, that rocker fish. An out pops booger thing. Let, let's see this drama play out again. Rock star fish, drum fish, or guitar fish. The, the sneaky manager with a gun ensues a dramatic fight to the death. <laughs> Those sounds are disturbing me. Let's enjoy this. What? 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 <laughs> that fish spun so quickly around in a circle that it transformed into a completely other fish. Let's see that again. What does this mean? What does that mean? It's become a solid. Oh my gosh, it's empty. It's hollow in the middle. Why? Why was it hollow? No. It like skipped a step. It was hollow. That's terrifying. Was that a glitch? That might have been a glitch. Let's see it again. It's not a glitch. It's just something that happens. Oh my gosh. No. Yes, birth many fish. I'm terrified of what the statue will do. Uh, apparently all the statues really need to have dental care. This is this is how we're uh, we're teaching kids about dental care through terror fish, terror. Uh, you didn't even brush the teeth that time. It's just wee 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 wee. Wee aw. The the joy of curls. The joy. Shoot him. It wouldn't be nice to hit somebody with our slingshot. Hey kid, you don't want to be hitting me with that slingshot, or I'll call in my debts that your papa owes me. You know, that kind of thing. All right. To the big city. Pulley Emporium. Hey, movies. Man, that, that fish has like a 10-pack ab. Hall of Fame. To the school. Luther, we're little fish in the big city. This is the big city. Freddy, will we still be friends when we're old? Yes, Luther. Even when we're 20. I, I deserve to save for that. Oh. Oh, what, 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 what should I even call this? Even when... No. No, 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 no. Big depression. Yeah. Yeah, the big city's going through a big depression right now. What luck? It's an urchin. Money. Wow! We have one purple steer. Wow! We have, we have, we, 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 we dropped that beat. We have, we have one purple steer. Does anybody remember Max Headroom? Headroom, the uh, the big creepy. Well, everybody, it's time for the 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 news. Remember that like weird glitchy VHS man? Yeah, Max Headroom, creepy. All right, where should we go? The Hall of Fame, Pulley Emporium, or to the movies? Well, it, what would it matter going to the movies or the Pulley Emporium if I don't know who's famous here? You know, if I go to the movies, yeah, I might see people, but I, don't, I won't know the reactions that people will have to them. So let's go to the Hall of Fame. Ooh. Apparently they put shoes in here. Message in bottle. Scholarly fish. Freddy, do you think we'll catch that ghost? I don't know, Luther. We'll just have to try our best. You were confident before. You were dead confident before, Freddy. You were like, oh, of course we can. There's no such thing as ghosts. Of course we'll catch it. It's it's uh, it's impossible for us not to fail. Now you're like, well, I don't know, Freddy. Or I don't know, Luther. Maybe. Maybe I want to see what this guy is. This like a uh, this looks like I'm going to I'm going to I'm going to predict this fish won like the hot dog eating contest of like 92. And this is him trying not to throw up. Oh, he did throw up. Magnificent. 
Paintings are alive! Run, Freddy! What about the shoes? I don't think you're allowed to live in these shoes. It's actually just a colony of, of beings living in shoes. These are the tap shoes Augie Octopus wore when he won the 24-hour tapathon. My god, 24 hours of tapping? Ugh. And I think... Have you ever seen somebody, like, really go off on, like, tap dancing? Like, uh... Hmm. <clears throat> have you ever seen uh, Singing in the Rain? Watch that movie and watch, like, just their feet or, like, them from, like, the waist down. The energy that they have to put into that is ridiculous. Um... One of the actresses, actually, the main actress, I can't remember her name right now, but in that movie, the main actress had to tap dance in heels, and she wasn't a big dancer. Like, she didn't, she wasn't like Gene Kelly, uh, who had a lot of dancing experience in his life. She was just kind of a, a random actress who, yeah, had been in other things, but she wasn't like a trained dancer. And she had to keep up with Gene Kelly's dancing in a few scenes while wearing heels, no less. And uh, her feet were actually, like, got to the point where they were bleeding and such. And later in life, uh, I remember there was an interview with her, and they asked about uh, the tap dancing experience and how painful it was. And she said that uh, the two most painful experiences in her life were childbirth, and then, more painful than that, the tap dancing. So, apparently tap dancing in heels is more painful than popping out a kid. So, uh, props to her for enduring that. Tina Tuna held her breath above water for 13 minutes. Oh, interesting. Poor t Tina, 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 come on. You don't need to impress us like that. My goodness. <laughs> oh, yeah, my teeth. What's with these statues and their teeth? Shiny teeth. Okay, that's disturbing. Sturgy Sturgeon won four gold medals in the All Ocean Powerlifting Competition. Interesting. I wonder if that's a crack in the statue right there, or if that's a vein in his head from lifting that. That bottle looks awfully familiar. Does it? <laughs> <laughs> Is it in a different game? Oh my gosh, you broke it! Oh, we just have a replica on hand. Mm, I'm just a delinquent in the museum, gonna be breaking artifacts. Oh, what does it matter? Oh, I'm dizzy now, better get out of here. And then the robot butler puts in another one. Is this from a different game? I feel like this is from a different Freddy Fish game. You're right! I will smile and wiggle my eyebrows at you. Hi, kids! Looking right at camera, hey, with my big, gross, mm, stone teeth that glimmer so sharply. Hector Tetra invented the cat Hector calculator Tetra? used in ocean research by kelpologists. Okay, okay, but Freddy, for real though, you gotta grow up. Remember, remember what they all told you? You won't be able to use a calculator when you grow up, or you gotta do this test without calculations because that's how real scientists do it. Bull oni, bull oni on that. Are you telling me the calc that scientists are willing to waste precious research time getting out a a pad of uh, a pad of paper and do all this like long division by hand, or are they just gonna take out their like calculator or phone and punch it in? Come on, mo time is money. You got, like, scholarship people. Wait, listen to the song. Oh, wait, no. For a second, it was making the sim a similar kind of, like, uh, like, jingle. Listen. Yeah, it's making, like, a similar kind of jingle to Super Mario RPG Legend of the Seven Stars when you're on Yoshi's Island. Nice. I'm liking it. Ooh, windy. You're curling my uh, tail coats. What about you? What? He's like, whoa, that was weird. Wow, this painting has a life of its own. Shock. This plaque says King Crab donated his pearls to build this Hall of Fame. Wow, really? This whole Hall of Fame took, like, the kingly pearls? <laughs> what stingy, like, uh, cave builders, my goodness. Yes, yeah, so, uh, sorry, we won't, we won't build this, like, exhibit for one, two, three, four, five, six things unless you give us the kingly pearls. I mean, yeah, it looks impressive from the outside, but really, this exhibit is very limited. Luther, we make a good team. They do. And you're my most valuable player. I'm not the most valuable player. I'm not the MVP of this game. My goodness, Lu uh, uh, Luther. <laughs> Freddy. You know, I don't know if Luther is in the other games. I think, because uh, this is Freddy Fish 2. Uh, the official title is Freddy Fish 2 Haunted... The case of the haunted schoolhouse. I think Luther might be an add-on. I don't know if Luther was in the first few games. It might have been Freddy all on his own, just commentating to himself. But then 
Maybe the humongous entertainment thought, man, he needs a friend. He needs a little companion. There's nothing more exciting than a day in the sea. Yeah, I bet, because everything's trying to eat you. 